Hi guys, I am back. This is part two. This is some of the stuff that I picked up at um, Tuesday morning. And uh, Tuesday morning, I haven't been there. I need to go. Hmm. Tuesday morning is already calling me. <laughs> um, TJ Maxx and uh, Home Goods. There it goes. It's pumpkin spice time here in my home. I love. Mm. Oh my god, this smells delicious. Um, I buy a lot of the holiday candles. I love them. Yankee Candle, at one point, I was crazy over. I mean, I still like them. But my daughter introduced me to Colonial Candles. And I find, my opinion anyway, I find that the scent lasts a lot longer than the Yankee Candle. I mean, this will burn down to the nitty-gritty, and it still smells just as strong. So... Pumpkin spice. You come to my home, that's all you will smell for the holidays. Anyway, uh, then I switch over to um, apple and cinnamon and then a mix of the pumpkin spice. Yep, that's what I do. So, you know, I found, but I didn't buy it because it was $14.99. And they also have the Martha Stewart punches. You would never believe, I mean, if you guys go, they were at one point $5.99 and $6.99. I didn't buy them. They were $12.99, guys. $12.99. I was like, oh, no. I um, I think I'm going to go tomorrow. There's another one of those things for the punch that I want to add. So I might go back and pick that one up. But first, got to make sure that I have the piece that goes with it. So I think I do. I'm, I need to check. There's a few pieces I saw also for doilies. And um, I want to get that. But anyway, I found these paper clips. And... Oh, it is. I thought so. Jumbo bow ties. That's what I saw. I might dollar ninety nine. I might check Marshalls tomorrow because if they had um, the Martha Stewart punch and it looks like one of the fairly new ones too, then it might be that they're floating around. Um, they should be coming out soon. So maybe they had them. I don't know, but I didn't take it because again I thought it was quite expensive. Um, American craft, look at this gold and polka dot, um, whatever you call this. Oh my God, what is wrong with me today? Oh, anyway, there you go. Whatever that is, something clip and a board there. Clipboard, there it goes. <laughs> oh my God, what is wrong with me? But yeah, I got that one. <laughs> Oh Lord, something's not some something wrong. I have uh, quite a few candles that I picked up. Anyway, that's what I got. And then at Home Goods, oh my God, look, look, can you see the legs? I am a sucker for these things. Let me just tell you. Look at these legs. <laughs> Isn't she beautiful? Look at her. Oh. And the arms are very flexible because I get she's got the wire there. As a matter of fact, I need to buy some and I forgot to get them. I usually pick them up a little roll of um the, you can use them on this type of dolls so that the arms you can bend, bend and fold. But anyway, she's a shelf sitter. Oh my god, she's what well, I call them shelf sitters because you know it's got that little hiney thing there. There you go. But look how beautiful she is. Isn't she adorable, guys? She looks like me. <laughs> oh my God, she's re uh, seriously, she's really cute. I love her. <laughs> Hi, welcome to my home. Oh my God, look how pretty. I just love, love, love her. She's adorable. She was nineteen ninety nine. My husband was like, "You're gonna spend twenty dollars on that?" I said, "Well, I want her." <laughs> she's adorable. Anyway, that's my witch. So I'm super excited about that. And then I also, like this isn't crafty, non-crafty, but I got this runner for my um, center table in my living room. And I thought it was so pretty. Look at that, guys. This was $12.99. So it might be a little bit too long. So what I do is I will and sew it again. So, and I'll probably add like something in the middle. How pretty. But isn't that beautiful? Good luck. 
on both sides. I love it. So I picked this up at Home Goods and then plenty, plenty, plenty of candles. Yep. Alrighty, guys. I think that is. Oh, actually, no, that's not it. I went to the dollar store and I remember Kim sharing um, the Ziploc, but I couldn't remember. Anyway, when I went to look for them, I think the size that they had was 10 by 11, and I found the 13 by 15 and 5 8, which is perfect, perfect for my 12 by 12 papers, my loose pages. So that is awesome. And I had to buy another one of these that I was using to store my, um, which I have in here. That's what I need bins for that also, to store my laces. And I want them in the transparent bin so that I can see them. And again, here is another one of, oh my God, this one's cinnamon, guys. Cologne, I'm like, I was just going to tell you guys, can you smell it? <laughs> Something's wrong with me today, definitely. <laughs> oh my God. Anyway, um, this smells really good. I love it. And again, if you guys haven't tried Colonial Candles, you should try it. The price is awesome. $5.99. And like I said, the scent will stay there all the way till the end. So that's what I love about the Colonial Candles. This bag is full of Colonial Candles. I think I picked up like... You may use 10 candles today, but it's because, um, again, when it starts, September comes, I just love, love, love the smell of pumpkin spice and everything nice. So I think that's, what else did I get at the dollar store I was going to share with you guys? Yeah, that's it. My candles and this. Hmm. I'm missing something else. I don't know what it was, but yep. And my little witchy girl, I just love her. She's so adorable. This is the second one like I purchased like this. And mind you guys, I I bought um I bought a magazine so that I can make my own dolls because it comes with a pattern. And it in one of those patterns it has a witch. So I was thinking about trying to make her, but I saw this one and I totally fell in love. I just love the color. And she's going to look perfect. I have one that stands up and this one that sits down in my dining. Actually, she might sit in my windowsill. I'll figure a place for her. I also have a little square box to sit her in, which I'm going to alter by coloring it in black. Did I even bring that up this way? I'm not even sure. Her face and her hands is ceramic. So, um, I just knew what did I do with it. See here. Oh, these are those hands I showed you. Okay. What did I do with it? Oh. Anyway, I don't know what it. Alrighty, guys. So that is it for now. I thank you all for watching and putting up with me today because I'm hmm, something's wrong. Um. Yeah, I think I'm just probably overexcited for that. Um, that witch that I just got. I just love them. And you know what, guys? I forgot to share with you guys my gel pens that I bought at the dollar store. Dollar Zone. That's the name of the store that I go to in Belleville. It's called Dollar Zone. I couldn't, like, remember the name of it for some reason. But these are so sweet when they write. It's like, um, it's so slippery. I mean, like, nice and smooth. Smooth, is that the word I'm looking for? I share with you guys and I love 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 this clipboard oh and I was telling you guys I had saw um, I seen I had saw I seen um, a, a punch from Teresa Collins but they had it for $14.99 and it's one that you would have to activate the code and um, whichever way you want your stamp they will mail it to you within five business days I was thinking about it. I was like you know what I think one time um, I ordered a stamp which I messed it up because I started cutting around it to make it smaller. That has my name on it, handmade by. And I bought one for my niece Jackie also, but I ruined mine. And I threw it out. So I have to get another one. And I love, love this clipboard. Oh, hello. That's that colorful. Um, see that? That's that colorful. <laughs> this. <laughs> oh, my God. 
these colorful pens. I am totally like zoned out. Isn't that pretty? I love, love, love it. And it does smear, so that's the only thing that, but it's nice and glittery. If you don't let it dry properly, you know, it does smear. And you can see the glitter on my finger. You see that? So it's one of those glitter pens, and they're so nice. And then I was cleaning out my my drawers there, and I found a whole bunch of stuff that I bought from. I mean, I knew that I had it, but, you know, out of sight, out of mind. Um, what are they called? Just excuse me for a moment. And, yes, I have pajama pants on with my T-shirt. Just in case you guys are seeing me from there. I don't know. Where is it? Maybe down here. Oh. Here. I have a bunch of them. And I, I mean, again, and these are watercolor pencils. And I bought all the colors that came out. I paid $4.99 for them. And it comes with a paintbrush. So I might start using these pretty soon. Gelatos, that's what it's called. You see, I have to see it. Oh. There you go. Gelatos, that's what I meant to say. Mix and match. And this one was $4.99 also from um, TJ Maxx. And again, like I said, guys, they have the punches from Martha Stewart, but $12.99. I was like, oh my God. But I think it's better than buying it at the store. No, actually, it's even cheaper. If you take a 50% coupon with you, you're paying $10 for it. So it doesn't make any sense. Sorry, TJ Maxx, but I mean, I wouldn't buy it, quite honestly. Because they are $19.99. And again, if you use a 50% coupon, you'll be paying $10 for it. So I didn't pick it up. Anyway, guys, again, thank you all for watching. <laughs> Um, anyway, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye for now.